The hydrogen of the OH group of phenol can be replaced by acyl group forming esters. Direct esterification of phenol using carboxylic acid in presence of dehydrating agent like concentrated sulfuric acid forms phenol esters but the reaction does not go to the completion. If we can see here phenol reacts with acetic acid in the presence of H plus to produce phenyl acetate and water. Acid chlorides and acid anhydrides react with phenols giving esters more easily, especially in presence of a base. While talking about carboxylic acid reacting with acetyl chloride, it removes the OH group here, thus forming C6H5O COCH3 along with hydrochloric acid. The same thing occurs when it is made to react with acetic anhydride. We would obtain acetic acid instead of hydrochloric acid. The reaction of phenols with benzoyl chloride in presence of sodium hydroxide to form benzoates is known as Scott and Bowman reaction. This is an example of Scott and Bowman reaction. When carbolic acid is made to react with benzoyl chloride along with NaOH, it forms phenyl benzoate and hydrochloric acid. Now let us study about etherification. Phenols react with alkyl halides or alkyl sulfates in presence of alkali to form phenolic ethers. Aryl halides do not react with phenols. This alkylation of phenol is a nucleophilic substitution reaction. This reaction is also known as Williamson synthesis. This is an example for Williamson synthesis reaction. When aromatic that is AROH reacts with in the presence of NaOH it produces ARO- along with sodium ion. Now let us discuss about carbolic acid. When carbolic acid reacts with dimethyl sulfate in the presence of sodium hydroxide it forms anisole along with methyl hydrogen sulfate. When carbolic acid reacts with bromomethane, this bromomethane, bromine here replaces the OH group to produce phenytol or ethoxy benzene along with hydrogen bromine. Now let us study about the reaction with phosphorus halide. The oxygen of the hydroxy group in phenol is strongly bound to the benzene ring hence it cannot be easily replaced. Though phenols react with PCl5 to give chlorobenzene, other reagents like HCl, PCl3 do not give chlorobenzene. The following reaction shows how hydroxyl group present reacts with PCl5 to form chlorobenzene, phosphoryl chloride and hydrochloric acid. The yield of chlorobenzene is very small and the main product is triphenyl phosphate that is nothing but C6H5O thrice PO. Diazomethane Diazomethane directly converts phenol to anisole in alkaline medium. That is carbolic acid reacts with diazomethane and removes the OH group to form anisole and nitrogen. This when heated with ammonia under pressure in presence of catalyst like anhydrous zinc chloride or calcium chloride even in the case of hydroxyl groups of phenols are replaced by amino groups. Let us now discuss this phenol groups reacting with ammonia in the presence of zinc chloride at 473 Kelvin will result in amino groups and water. Now let us study the reaction with ammonia.